G'day Marshmallows and welcome back to the Coco Couch. We are watching Spirit, Stallion of the Cimarron. I don't really know a lot about this movie, but so many of you guys in the comments have been suggesting that I should watch it. Apparently it's about a horse and like some sort of journey that they go on throughout the movie. Apparently there isn't a lot of talking, which honestly to me, I'm really in the mood for. Just something that speaks more through the storytelling opposed to any sort of dialogue or exposition or that sort of thing. I even like the style just based on the cover, which is saying a lot about this movie. Yeah, guys, I don't know much about it. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Wow. Oh, the clouds are horses. That's cool. It looks pretty good, honestly. When did this come out? Wow. Like outside of the eagle, like just the landscape and the, how smooth it is, is just gorgeous. They say the history of the West was written from the saddle of a horse, hmm. but it's never been told from the heart of one. Right. Like the wind in the buffalo grass, we belonged here. We would always belong here. A time when wild horses ran free. Oi! Hey! Goodness gracious. If I was standing there, I would have died. This is making me want to watch Man from Snowy River. Fantastic Aussie film. Yeah, like I said, like, obviously the animation of the things that are moving has aged a bit, which is fine. But the landscape is gorgeous, man. Look at this. <laughs> oh, shoot. Yeah, she's proganinant. Bruh, she has no one helping. They'll just watch from a distance. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I guess they just see their fingers crossed. Well, hooves crossed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, buddy. I love this. No, no words. It's just like the expression. Oh, I love it. I come to this world so wild and free. Right, so this is our first song. <laughs> There's so much expression with this, despite it looking so realistic. Oh. Land, and it's way yeah, need that milk. Bruh. <laughs> hot, yeah, Dang, bro, those are some strong legs. <laughs> Just move. Here I am. You could say he has a lot of spirit, huh? Don't lick it. <laughs> oh, bro. Gotta learn the hard way. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Uh, we good? Yeah, right. Shivers. <laughs> He's got a lot of courage, man, this horse. I love it, even the expression, like the raised eyebrow when he looked his mate. I'm, I'm going to breathe in his face. I loved it. Oh, look at this guy. As wild and reckless as thunder over the land. Flying? There were times I believed I could. <laughs> A beautiful stallion too, by the way. Come on, man. Beat your PB. <laughs> Like my father before me, I became leader. And oh. with that honor came responsibility. Shivers, mate. All right. I guess it's a good thing he's got so much spirit. Hey. Dude. <laughs> Shivers. Yeah, bro. Kick those hind legs. Yes. Crush it. Ooh. Wow, only a warning. <laughs> That'll teach it. Far out. Yeah, honestly, that takes so much bravery. <laughs> yeah, they look up to him so much, I bet. It's wild like the river. Mate. It's here. This is where that is just gorgeous. Far out, mate, this movie. 
pretty rare when I get goosebumps watching some scenes in films, but I've already got like three instances already. <laughs> I just love watching them behave, like just being social. It's so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> Go to sleep. Far out. What's the lifespan of a horse? I, for some reason, I feel like I should know this, but I don't. Yeah, I bet the stars were incredible. Like no light pollution at all. Oh, speaking of which, far out. Hmm. Yeah, he's a bit curious, isn't he? Yikes. Something new came upon the land one night that would change my life forever. Wait, just like that? He's like, bye. <laughs> I haven't thought about that. Hey, like when humans turn up, how animals have to adapt as well to that. It's almost like that they get used to humans right? being around. <clears throat> oh, dude, get out. Bro, he's telling you leave. <laughs> Oh, he's a bit too curious. A wiser horse might have turned and run, but I wanted to know what strange creatures were here. I hate how I don't even know who these characters are, but I'm already fearing for this horse's life. That's how sad this is. Oh, bro. <laughs> There's a horse in my boot. Look at that stallion. It's beautiful. Please be nice people. Darn it, man. They see something beautiful and they just want to capture it. Bro! <laughs> oh, dude was dreaming too good. <sighs> Darn it, bro. Can he hide? Yeah, I guess um, this stallion would be worth a lot, hey. <laughs> Mate, he's very curious and he got himself in trouble, but I'm glad he's got enough wit to outsmart them. Nice. Ah, oh, darn it, bro. It's not like other animals. They'll persist. Yikes. <laughs> yeah, because if they saw the herd, they'd put a lot of effort into capturing all of them. So that was really brave of him. <laughs> Parkour? Bro, he's a mountain goat. He's just having fun throughout this whole thing. Darn it. Gosh, this is so sad to watch. Oh. Don't get yourself hurt. Gosh, man. That was a lot expressed without words. <laughs> Goodness me. <laughs> and I didn't know what was going to happen to me, but at least my mother and the herd were safe. Yeah, nice. It's so dumb to me when you hear the human characters be like, oh, this thing's crazy. I'm like, bro, what do you think it's going to do? It had a free life, beautiful life. And then it suddenly gets captured by these strange people. What do you, what do you think it's going to do? Like, <laughs> yeah, I just, I just hate the whole mentality of thinking this thing belongs to them just because they found it, you know? You can't come out oh, that's right. They're friends, aren't they? <laughs> Oi, that is a good shot. Once again, the animation is just incredible. I wonder what they did. Are they all paintings or like watercolor? Oh boy. It makes all these trained and like broken horses. It seems even sadder now. It's disgusting, man. What seems to be the problem, gentlemen? The army has dealt with wild horses before. This one will be no different. 
Yikes. Maybe a bit more difficult. This one didn't look like a rattler. I was still thinking snake. Hmm. That's an American if I ever saw one fire. We'll see how wild he is when I'm done with him. Oh, shoot. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, shoot, bro. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna be their entertainment now. <laughs> so much effort. <laughs> Yikes, bro. <laughs> Mate, they're desperate. Oh, yeah, he'd be out. Yeah, shucks, bro. <laughs> Mate, he's giving him hell. <laughs> Damn, bro. Well done, mate. Not the stables. It's time to break that horse. I know who that voice actor is. I've just figured it out. Uh, he's he's much older bloke. What have I seen him in? I know he's from Babe. If you wanna have a go, let you know. Good luck, guys. I <laughs> wish you luck. <laughs> oh boy. Got to give props to these guys for being so brave. <laughs> you done goofed up. I love how much personality this horse has. No, oh, <laughs> sorry, sir. <laughs> I'm just worried they're going to try to hurt him, you know? Get off of my back. Ooh. <sighs> Shivers. Sergeant, no food or water. Three days. Yikes. Yeah, I was afraid something like that was going to happen. They're just going to hurt him because he wouldn't submit. It is interesting to see that the people that are, have captured him, right? They're the only species of, like, creature that this horse has seen that's communicated so much with him. They have so much personality, right? I'm just trying to put myself in the mind of this horse. <laughs> I don't know. It'd just be weird meeting some species of creature that is so horrible to you, but is also communicates with you more than any other animal. My heart galloped through the skies that night, and I wondered if they missed me as much as I missed them. Of course they do. Man. This is not good, man. I'm getting like really emotional just from little bits like that. I don't know why, like what it is about this movie, but just the silence and the, the horse's facial expressions, it just does it for me. <laughs> oh, this is what he wants. Submit and you'll get some water. Oh, here we go. Here's the more extreme uh, example of what this story's trying to tell, it seems. Corporal, take him to the stockades. The post. No food or water. Maybe these two could team up. Break out of here. Yeah, probably a bit more in touch, right? <laughs> With nature and balance. Oh, bro, what? He's the only human here that's trying to communicate with you properly. <laughs> oh shoot that's so cool he's got mates outside <laughs> come on mates they've requested additional patrols fetch my crop and spurs he's oh, see he's arrogant but kind of so is the horse but mm. oh, yeah. here we go Yikes. It's like they're two equals. They both have a lot of spirit, except the humans, the bad, and the horse is really good. Eee! He could crush your leg though, mate. Oh, he's trying everything. Oh, just the fear there. Like, oh gosh, am I going to lose? Any horse can be broken. I hate this. So wrong. A hostile Lakota will never submit to Providence. It's awful. Oh, he's broken their spirit too by giving up. Sometimes a horse has got to do a horse has got to do. And this was one of those times. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, 
Bye! Hell yeah. He will never be broken, bro. <laughs> yes! Come on! Look at that, mate. You've psyched up all your buddies. Secure that horse! <sighs> I hate that. I can't control it. I'll just kill it. Yes! Come on! Yes! Come on, mate! <laughs> yes, free your pals while you're at it. Yes! Does this count as him letting him ride him? Yes. Come on, mate. <laughs> really? Good luck. <laughs> what did he think was going to happen? <laughs> I wasn't sure what happened back there. I wasn't about to stop and ask. Yeah, for real. Oh... Of course, a love interest. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. More ropes. Yeah, right. Bro got charmed. This might be a good thing, though. It might show him the other side of humanity. They might treat him with a lots of care. Either way, I think he should still be back with his family, but... <laughs> I'm not going to hurt you. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. Developing trust. I think it's going to take a while, though, with this one. To break a horse the proper way, doesn't it take, like, weeks? <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Tasty little treat. <laughs> he likes what he sees. <laughs> Here comes the showing off. <laughs> it's not what it looks like, mate. He's, like, disgusting. <laughs> It is beautiful to see them playing like that, though. <laughs> I couldn't understand it. She treated this scrawny two-legged like one of our kind. <laughs> it was downright unnatural. Well, maybe if you get their trust, you can go out there and have some fun, too. Today, I will ride you. No, oh, please. We've been here before. <laughs> Damn, bro. Ho, 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 ho! Mayors. <laughs> that was literally the alternative to women. <laughs> that was great. Yeah, it seems like maybe the best way to get to him is to have her go with him. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh. So petty. <laughs> oh boy. Here we go. Be careful, bro. Yep. <laughs> bro is learning a lot in such a short amount of time. Okay, I admit it. She was charming mm -hmm. in a stubborn, irritating kind of way. Yeah, like you, mate. <laughs> Yeah, for the horses, they're like, look at these tattoos, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Yeah, how do you like that, mate? Hmm. Even if he's not, like, taming him, it's like at least having fun together. It's kind of earning his trust slowly. Oh, yikes. Patience. See, even he can't deny the child. <laughs> so pure. Oh, bye bye, horsey. That's so precious. She's like, ooh, he does have a sensitive side. <laughs> yeah, he's just angry and stressed because he's far away from his flipping family and home. I don't blame him. Whoa. That was impressive, bro. Oh, come on. Accept my gift, please. <laughs> That's adorable. Yeah, like deep down, he's a caretaker. Like he wants to protect and serve. He's just been in an environment where he's been trying to push everybody away because they've treated him like trash. <laughs> Aww. Hey, 
It's literally the same as Rio. They're chained together birds. <laughs> What was that about? Did his eagle friend like just not recognize him or something because of his life here? Yeah. For the first time in my life, I felt my heart torn two ways. Hmm. It's a pretty good problem to have to be torn between two really perfect, wonderful lives. <laughs> He's messing with you. He just likes to. Ugh, gosh. So rude, man. <laughs> Bro. He just like stood up for him like that. It's like despite not letting him ride him, he's just like, he still cares about him. Wow. That's a powerful bond, though, to form after that much time being stubborn. I'm never gonna ride you, am I? And no one ever should. I love how even he respects that, though. He sees his personality, and he's like, yeah. You can go. Yeah. There's no point in having him around then, right? Get out of here! Gee, alright. Yeah, but what about his missus? What happened to what's her name? Oh, okay, so he had a plan. Yeah, come with me. Uh, I think she's more bonded with them though. Yeah, dude. This is so sad, man. I didn't know we were gonna get such a drama from this movie. I knew this was hard for her, but more than anything, I wanted to share my homeland with her. Oh, I know exactly what that is. Gosh, man. Flippin'... Ugh. Yeah, but she loves the people that are living there, bro. Ugh. Yikes. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's horrible, mate. Dude, dude! Did he actually get one of them? Oh, that was lucky. Hey, <laughs> yeah, an old friend, huh? Okay, so I guess he shot neither of them. Oh, dude. This is almost certain death, man, going down this rapid. Dude, this guy's going through hell in this movie, for love. Oh. Mate, he's pretty strong to do this. The water, yeah. by the way, the water animation's incredible. Sorry, but... <laughs> oh. Dude. Is that survivable? It has to be. <laughs> oh, please. Please be okay, man. Is that a I'm okay, I'm just tired, or is she actually injured? What does this mean? I lay beside her that night, praying that somehow she would be okay. Come on, man. Oh, get stuffed, mate. Get out of here. Oh, I flippin' hate him, man. Can he not have a moment? He's not gonna make it. <sighs> it's flippin'... Ah, oh, man. This movie's making me feel all sorts of things. This is the second time he's being ripped away from somebody he loves. Oh, thank God this guy's here. Maybe he can help her. Easy, girl. I'm so glad this guy went out and found them. You saved my life. Yeah. He's literally given up everything, man. He's been able to go to freedom twice, but I do love that about his character. Like, above everything else, he wants freedom. But <laughs> his relationships and his protective side dominates it slightly. 
slightly more important to him. Oh, those are the other horses from the village. Oh, yeah, he's he's lost pretty much all hope at this point. He's lost his spirit. Play it just for me. And how far away from home is he going to go now? No, I can't go. Oh, it's like they're just trying to hold on to hope, and this this stallion like gives them that courage. Come on, man, eat. It's beautiful to see them trying so much to help their pal. Oh, here we go. Hallucinations. I wonder if that's out of hunger or sleep deprivation. Man. This poor stallion, man. This flipping sucks. This movie's sad. It better have a really good resolution. I do actually like the music over most of this movie. It makes it feel like a really dramatic music video. <laughs> a really emotional one. You're a now. Be free once more. Uh, yeah, that was a great scene. And the whole uh, You're a Soldier song as well, it kind of encapsulated that little arc there. Like, don't give up, mate. You gotta stick to it. Don't lose hope. Mate, he's like the leader of all horses <laughs> in every environment. <laughs> I love the communication, man, without dialogue. It's great. We had to find a way to escape and get back home. Hell yeah. Bro, are you kidding me? He's not going to give up? What an absolute G. I bet he has that sort of mentality, like, I owe him my life, so this is- I'm indebted to this horse now. Ready to go! Yeah! Bro. Yeah, I know, right? How much <laughs> horsepower do you need to move this thing? <laughs> what? That is awful. Yeah! yeah, back off, mate. So what that took all day and night. Bro. Yeah, how much further are they going? That was the moment I understood. They were headed to my homeland. Yeah. Come on, man. You got to rally all the horses to do this. Oh, okay. That too. That little side eye. Oh man, the horses should know him by now to be like, there's no way he's gone. <laughs> yeah, come on. This fails, he could die though. Oh, oh dude, yes. Oh, dude, you better break the other one. Otherwise the other horses aren't going to be able to take it. They'll just get dragged down the hill. Dude, come on. Okay, good. Good on you, man. <laughs> Dude, this horse is parkour. Ooh, shivers, man. Is this horse gonna single-handedly prevent the US from being colonized? <laughs> Just go left! Go <laughs> every time, bro! Yikes, bro. It's a good thing he's fast. Okay, now swerve. Now go left. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> this is insane, bro. Ooh. Okay. Oh, yikes. Oh, he's going to start a forest fire. Nice. He might have caused some more deaths now, but prevented a lot in the future, I imagine. Uh, come on, mate. Ah, oh, dude, it had to happen at some point. I was like, why does he start this chain on? Yes, yes, yes! Bro rocks up at the best times. Come on, come on! <laughs> 
Oh gosh. <laughs> well, at the start of the movie, he said he felt felt like he could almost fly sometimes. <laughs> the amount of times he's been flying in this film. <laughs> nice. I don't know where he came from or how he got there, but I sure was happy to see him. <laughs> Hell yeah, you would be. <laughs> Dude, this horse is always playing. <laughs> I love how he let him do that though. Just have some fun. Freedom! I knew I would find you. Uh oh, come on, mate. It doesn't end. I don't believe it. <laughs> I bet they don't either. <laughs> Save him, please. Let him ride you on you, please. All right. <laughs> Only in life or death situations can you ride me. <laughs> yeah, you're still being pursued. <laughs> I do love, though, that he never tamed him or broke him. He just formed such a strong bond that he's just letting his friend ride on his back, you know? Oh! oh, that guy could have broken his neck. Oh, shivers, all right. He's not the only stallion that can parkour. Wow. That was impressive. Oh, the horse did that on purpose. I love that. They're all working for him now. Put on those brakes. Damn, mate. Bro, please. There you go. <laughs> Nicely done. Really? That's it? A dead end? Uh. Oh, what? I keep forgetting he's a mountain goat. Fire out. Wait, excuse me? How? Dang. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's okay. He's just letting his endurance meter build. Yeah, literally. <laughs> that's, he's just waiting for it to come back up. <laughs> All right. Come on, mate. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> okay. That's some conviction if I ever saw it. Well, he's flying. Like he said. That takes some guts. <laughs> Bravo, man. <laughs> I can't believe they made that. <laughs> Don't you dare. Yeah, even he can't deny. Yeah, he earned that freedom. Far out. At least he has a little bit of humanity. Far out. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, look, if he doesn't ride you, he's going to probably die out here in the desert. <laughs> nice. Good song choice. I'm free. So where are they going? Is he going straight home or is he going to drop him off somewhere? Right. I'm guessing that's the same group of people that just survived, just relocated. His... Okay. His lady friend should be here, please. <laughs> please. Yes, he is. Yes, yes, yes. Finally, please. Can we tie all loose ends? I need a happy ending. <laughs> Both her favorite men are here. <laughs> Always got to have a good victory dance first before the cuddle. <laughs> Bro, these, these horses have been through it. Aww. You will always be in my heart. Yeah, how did that feather not fall out at all in this film? <laughs> Even the waterfall? Take care of her. Spirit who could not be broken. Aww. That's so sweet, man. <laughs> Damn. 
Dang it, man. <laughs> the expression in their eyes is so deep. That goodbye was harder than I ever imagined. I'll never forget that boy. Yeah, man. <laughs> That's the thing, man. You spend so much time somewhere else. Life just happens wherever you are. And yes, that was a quote from Uncle Iroh. <laughs> I'm so glad this part is so untouched. It's so gorgeous. <laughs> yes, I'm back. <laughs> you thought I was dead. Nope. <laughs> this is so sweet, man. I guess his mum and his lady friend didn't need an introduction. <laughs> That's literally the same clip from the start of the movie, except he's got his wifey there. <laughs> it's to you. Oh, that's awesome, man. Return. Mate, that was a gorgeous film. Fire out, mate. Mate, this movie just absolutely took my breath away. That was... <sighs> it's so rare when you come across a movie like this. I feel like some aspects of it aged, you know, a bit. Yeah, I, I feel like the story was very simple. I don't think it's hard to compare it to masterpieces, but it just made me feel so much throughout it. And that, I think that's what you want out of a really good film. I just, I, it was just a roller coaster of emotions. I was so invested in this, this stallion story. I wanted him to get home so badly. And I feel like this movie could have easily been like really shallow, but it had so much spirit and that's what the movie's called it's just the way that the movie allowed the horses to just express themselves through like their their eyes and without any dialogue i think is just incredible i think if this movie was made today they'd try to make the the animals talk and stuff and it just take away from what this movie really felt like it was just gorgeous and like the landscapes the art it was just phenomenal and yeah, I think I think the only thing I was kind of a bit 50-50 um, with was just the, the exposition. I wonder what this movie would be like if there was no exposition at all. And like, just no talking. It was just the, maybe some of the talking from the human characters and that was it. Uh, I wonder just how much different it would have been, whether it would have made that much of a difference or not. Because I just feel like there was so much storytelling just through the expressions of particularly the main stallion spirit. And like, I feel like the reason why I get so emotional in a movie like this is because when there isn't any dialogue, when there isn't, um, the, the movie isn't telling you what to feel, you kind of feel the gaps yourself. When a, a character is expressing something and there's no one telling you how to feel, you feel that void like you feel what the character's feeling more often and yeah i think also another element to it is the fact that they're just animals i think that we just have a natural inclination to empathize more with just the innocence that they carry uh and yeah i think that's kind of how i felt particularly about the stallion was um i think one of the main re main reasons you root for him so much isn't just because of the amount of spirit he has and his determination. It's also just how pure he is and how innocent he is. Like he's just a part of nature almost. He's like this entity that's just supposed to be free and wild and not meant to be controlled. And yeah, then humans come around. I did like that they kind of went with the route of showing us the worst that humans are capable of as well as the good side of it you got to see that character who was the native american come in and um show the stallion what it's like to have a relationship with them that's healthy and i i think that that was really important just yeah to show the the good and the bad there um yeah 
I really, I really liked it. It was a fantastic film. It was very short and the pacing made it feel like there was a lot in it, which I really liked. And I think it was beautiful at the end after they made that cliff jump, how that general dude or whatever his name was, he allowed them to go. Um, obviously they had no choice, but they, he couldn't capture him anymore, but the, the, he allowed him to live. It's yeah, he, I think he had some character growth there. It doesn't excuse the horrible things that character's done, but it is nice to see that even in the one of the worst characters in the film, there is still that humanity there, that empathy to understand, okay, this is something that I can't touch. Uh, even this mo the most controlling character in the film is has to let go. I, I really, I really liked that. And it shows that this stallion inspired not just all the horses throughout the film, it also inspired the enemy and that that's so cool it's so cool man i absolutely adore this movie it was so cute so wholesome and it's very inspiring and uh it, it certainly made me feel really good coming out of it so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this please like and subscribe and i will see you all next time stay cozy